Welcome to Spanky Bob! It is snowing, baby. Hello, interwebs. Here we are, episode 69, dude. This is a big deal. We are on the 69th episode of Schmangy Vlogs. 4.15 p.m. We are set up here at the Frog Alley Brewery. Happy to be back. Happy to be back. Hopefully, people show up. We don't know what the fuck's gonna happen with all the snow coming down. This might be just another day, you know? The people might just drive out here in the snow and come and party. That's what we're hoping for. But anyways, I'm feeling good. Yesterday, we got in real late middle of the night at the casino we pulled up to the casino and kevin went into that casino and he came out a victorious man hopefully the victories keep rolling let's check up on everybody here let me flip it brian meeks kevin feller flavor king brian how you feeling today i feel good feeling feel all right good. yeah how do what, you feel Corey? How I, I told him i'm feeling pretty good myself you look really tired in the camera lens right now yeah. not gonna lie <laughs> what what huh what? brian needs a nap Kevin, pre-gaming, got the Pepsi rolling. All good, man. How you doing? Feel I was good. telling them you won yesterday yeah. in the casino. A little bit, yeah, a little bit. Late night, driving in, I had to kind of wind down, play a little bit. It's a beautiful wintry day in Schenectady. I don't know what tonight's going to bring, but whatever it's going to bring, it's going to bring. That's right. And uh, please give. <laughs> it's that time of year. If you look below the screen, you will see in the ticker below, 1-800-THUNDER, baby. Give us a call. Donate now, please. Here they are, the superstars. Yeah, look at him. He's so happy. And the Flavor King standing next to him. How is the superstars doing over here? Well, I mean, come to the show. When you get here, don't go away. Say 20 minutes later. So Just long. to make things right. <laughs> I love it. Oh. Did you have anything meaningful to add? <laughs> Don't go away. Cut all that cut all that crap out. No, at least put a segment in no, a little segment. Not. Kyle, how are you doing? I'm doing good. I gotta get drink up there as hell. Getting this guitar back in shape. Broke the yeah. string. Did Brian seal up that string? Was he it, did. This is this a job by Brian? How would you grade his stringing jobs? Uh, I checked the tuning today. We were gonna check it after the show, but we didn't because we're like, I'll just figure it out. But it was about 17 semitones too flat, so I don't think the weather's gonna affect it that Seven much. Semitones. That's Seven. what Christina said, right, Brian? 17 semitones, semitones too flat. <laughs> So what's the grade? Then we're going with a three out of four stars. Three out of four, three out of four. stars. Yes, on the four stars. That's a seventy-five percent. Well done, Brian. A lot better because I didn't give you that high, so yeah, your average is going up, man. Yeah, it was Good a, job, Brian. I was gonna say it was a clean job, and the only thing that wasn't like perfect was the tuning. So if I would have broken another string and picked this guitar up, would have went to play it, it would have been horribly out of tune, but. Well done, Brian. Good job. And last but not least, Chris Jones, how you doing? Ready to do some jazz tonight. Call 188-BEATLE-JAZZ. Six fifty-eight p.m. Showtime has come us, and uh, as we've kind of expected in our webs, there ain't too many people here. But we're gonna have a good time. It's gonna be a good time as always. We might have a special guest here tonight. I don't know. I think he's coming. Kyle, Showtime. How you feeling? Feeling good. Yeah. Feeling loose. Getting them noodles loose. Oh. oh yeah. Kevin, how you feeling? I don't know. How are you feeling? I said there ain't too many people here, but I'm feeling okay. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm ready to rock it. I feel good. We're going to rock. We're going to give it the show. I mean, but the weather, you know, it's not good. The weather's not good up here. So. It is not. It's still snowing. But hopefully they'll get on their feet and come up front and they'll rock with us, man. That's it, man. Chris Jones, yeah. how are you feeling? I'm feeling Gucci. Gucci, man. You're jazzed out. Cool. Ready for some jazz. I'm tell you my name. Brian, how you feeling? You doing all right, Brian? I feel good. Showtime. Showtime. Everybody's ready. The main man tonight on the sound, Doug. He's going to fucking thump it. He's going to kill it. And Bobby Lee, how you doing, Bobby? Hey, Rock, left my rock and roll shoes back at the hotel, so tonight, I'm going to be wearing these Pumas. It looks, the like, Pumas. Uh, looks like, you know, Bobby up at Rock and nobody will probably even notice, but to me, it looks like I ought to be working on a roadside somewhere going. 
I don't agree with that. Those are some cool pumas. They just stay orange. Bobby's crazy. Yeah. He's too picky. I'm internet. a back in black rocker. Everything black. needs to be black for Bobby. No. And there goes the wireless. Blue jeans. Oh, it's madness. We're getting ready. See you later. p.m. Frog Alley Brewery in the books. We could add a little bit more attendance, but hey, in our webs, you know, it's fucking snowing outside, and it is what it is. We've been here a couple times now, and it's kicked ass and stuff, and anybody who's here, Chris Jones, what'd you think? Frog Alley Brewery. I thought we were a little loud during sound check. I'm not gonna lie. Loud during sound check. We got loud in trouble. Check, yeah. yeah. 114 DB. Bobby's being too loud and obnoxious on the microphone during sound check. We got yelled at. It was also like, oi, 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 you know, building up to my... <laughs> So it probably was both. What'd you think of the show? I thought it was great, especially this little nice, awesome item that cool Vinny Mussolino got me for my birthday. I mean, look at this. It looks like Jason standing there. You know what it kind of looks like? You guys ever seen that movie Castaway where he gets the Wilson? Oh, yeah. <laughs> bleeding and you know, this would be great to have on a desert island. Yeah. I thought it was kind of like a pineapple, you know, where they Wilson in that one movie, uh, Little Nicky, where they're shoving the pineapple up Hitler's ass. <laughs> You're serious. Thank you, Benny. This is great birthday stuff. You know me, buddy. I love this. I love it. And now we're hitting the road in the snow. What's up, Kyle? Please donate. <laughs> we're gonna, we're gonna, we'll bring back an old school vlog number. one 900 jughead <laughs> Call in. Please donate. Anything that you can give, we appreciate. Please and thank you. See you in Deary North. <laughs> I was gonna say North Hampshire. New Hampshire. Bye-bye. Three forty-two p.m. Deary, New Hampshire, inside the Tupelo Music Hall. I like to say Tupelo because Tupee, baby, right? Hey. Anyways, we're here, Flavor King. What do you got going on today? Just me cleaning my strings. Make sure. There you go, next time. Maximize the life out of each set. Well, who's your string cleaning company? What you got there in your hand? Dunlop, baby. The Ultra Glide 65. Let's see what else we got going on. What do you got going on today, Bobby? How you doing? About wrapped up. Just taped down the 
pedals and the extra work Kyle made me do to tape down those because he wanted the cannons to move back. But that's all good. Teamwork <laughs> makes the dream work, baby. <laughs> Come on down here. Get our little green room area here at the Music Hall. Beautiful place. Brian Meeks, found by the cookies. <laughs> How you doing? Hey, Brian, what's going on? Oat oh, milk, no. coconut, chocolate chip cookies. We are at the Tupelo Music Hall here in New Hampshire, and we're gonna check in on a live look at the Star Wars Uno game. Here's Corey Bates laughing at me because this is the second tip in this video. Now I got like 16. Wow, he's got like 60, 16 <laughs> cards, all different colored. We got Kyle here. He's not one to show us. Oh, there it is. Ooh, four. Oh, look at that. Let me see if I have any yellow cards. All right, what do you got? He's got yellows. quite a few there. <laughs> I mean, quite a few. But right now, if, if we hard. were if we were doing this by the amount of cards, I think Kevin would win. Look Kevin's got a couple. <laughs> he's got a couple decks. Kevin, over there. Kevin's got a full deck of really Uno cards. What I right turn, right? He's <laughs> he's building to host his right, own here's game. Another draw two for Kyle. Ooh, a draw two for Kyle. <laughs> You're wondering why I'm not playing. Up. It's Still because up. there's some kind of funky oh, house rule that they're play playing by yellow, that you can yellow. stack draw Several cards. Funky house rules. And that's just something that I don't play by. We don't do house rules. We just play straight up. But that's okay. They're having fun. And okay, we're having fun. Kevin's See how many freaking fun. cards I got? Dude, I had one card I called Uno. Kevin. <laughs> this is what happens. TBH. We you're doing you're doing okay. TBH. TBH. We got him involved in a Star Wars activity. That's Highly unusual. True. This is not a Star Wars activity. Sure and it is. We got three PO and Leia. He just and showed us all his cards. And, and <laughs> Kevin and <laughs> Kevin did. I'm sorry. Kevin sure. did want us to call him Jar Jar Pinks no, for the Kevin, game. Kevin did not. This is not a Star Wars event. <laughs> yeah. And we are playing the Star Wars. Give it, Bobby. Because if not, I'm gonna throw all these fucking cards in the air. Turn the fucking red. He can be Boba Feller. Boba Feller. It's great. Red. Good one, Bobby. <laughs> so the winner by card Six. number only Six. is Corey. Eight. Eight. Six. Nine. Eight. Seven. Eight. Eight. Nine. Twenty. The rest of the deck. <laughs> 7.56 p.m. Four minutes. Four minutes away from showtime. Fuck, man. This place is fucking pretty good internet. I think we've got about like 320 people here, something like that. So for our first time in the state, for our first time here, awesome turnout for us, in my opinion. The place holds about like 550, and we're just fucking under that. So, hey, here is Kevin Feller. Let me flip it. How you feeling, Kevin? Rock and roll up here in New Hampshire. First Hell. time. Farthest east we've been, but we will be further one day. Maybe. Maine, Canada. Maine. Could be Canada one of these days. You never know. And then over his shoulder, look at him over there. You can barely see him. Kyle suiting up. Please give. Please, Please give. give. Please give, yes. <laughs> the All the number on your screen below. It's still rolling, baby. We're still rolling it. Here comes Chris. Chris, how you feeling? Bonsoir. Look at these two over here. We got Brian. We got Bobby. How's everybody feeling? Pretty good. I, you know, didn't lose the Uno game, and just playing with Star Wars cards was fun for me. It's gonna be a killer show.
Yellow submarine is packed, packed to the brim, baby. 11.17 p.m. Tupelo Music Hall in the books. Awesome time, awesome debut show. Laid it down, gave it to him real good. Show went smoothly. I broke one little snare strap, had to swap my snare. Chris, what do you think? Good weekend. Any... Tonight was killer. Made up for last night. Kyle, this is it. Yeah. Wrapping it up. Yeah. Final words. Well, this is the, the end of the first week of the chapter of Thunderstruck. I want to dub the yellow pages. Like the phone book. We got the yellow submarine. Bobby, final words. Absolutely terrific show tonight here in New Hampshire. What a time. These people rocked, although they did sit down. They were sitting mesmerized in such awe of the band. We brought the high voltage spirit of ACDC to this state. No doubt about it. It was great. Much better than other shows we've played, you know, in the past a couple, I don't want to name names, but, you know, we have good ones, we have bad ones. Tonight one was a freaking great one, as far northeast as we've ever been, ever put my feet this far northeast. We rocked them. I thought it was great. See ya. Time for vegetables. Kevin, how was it? What do you guys say? Oh, we got Brian, too. Hey. He's still in my time. Yeah, he did. And Chris is getting pissed. It's all good, man. Above expectations. Yep. Please help. <laughs> And last but not least, oh yeah, baby. Next week, one show, the Christmas Throwdown, Little Miami Brewing Company. I think it's in Cincinnati, Ohio, right, Chris? Is that right? We'll see you there Friday night. Myra Kuruma, goodbye. How you doing today, Chris? What's going on in here? The balls. Ah!